Ever since I've smoked cigars, we have been considered pariahs, outcasts. A cigar store is something sacred that we as a subculture can come and share the same similar interest. But as a cigar smoker, we weren't allowed to smoke in 90% of the places that allowed cigarette smoking anyway. I think our store definitely has become a haven for a lot of our customers. They come in once a week, right? Yeah, about once a week. There are guys that it's like clockwork. What's going on, Todd? Hey, Sean. At 11 o'clock, 11, 10 every day, they come in on their lunch break. They'll have a 45 minute cigar and go home. I'm a teacher. I'm an electrician. I'm a real estate investor. I'm an evangelist. I'm a deputy sheriff. Why I like smoking cigars? It gets the blood flowing. It gets the blood flowing in my veins. <laughs> My name is Eric Parkinson. My brother and I own Shades of Havana Fine Cigars in Peoria, Arizona. My name is Sean Parkinson. Working in the cigar business and owning a, a retail cigar store, I do have the best job in the world. Every time I smoke a cigar, I think of the numerous vacations and days out on the patio with my dad and my brother. My father taught me everything about cigars, everything, from cutting to lighting to smoking, different ways to enjoy, to taste. Being in business with my brother is one of the most amazing things I've ever done. Sean tends to be more regimented. Uh, Sean likes his schedules, his routines. I'm in sports. He has nothing to do with sports. He's more musically and artistically inclined than I am. I am recently married with two wonderful teenagers. Mow the backyard and make sure you take out all the garbage, okay? And four uncontrollable animals. Whoa. Who are the cigars for? They're for my stepdad. He's retiring today. Okay. A buddy of mine is getting ready to have a baby, and I wanted to get a box of cigars. The reasons people buy cigars are about as many as cigars as I have in the humidor. First time I ever had a cigar, I picked it up off the ground in the middle of a cotton field. First cigar made me feel sick. My first cigar was actually here. There are no taboos and no stereotypes. I have as many women coming in to buy cigars for themselves as they do to come in to buy cigars for their husbands. I love the taste. I love the smell of cigars. Every cigar is like a bottle of wine. They're all different. I walk in here on any given day and you can see a 20-year-old college student scraping by to pay tuition, sitting next to a 55-year-old retired multimillionaire sharing a cigar and talking about today's events. Cigars unite people.